thank you. Well, hello? Can you hear me? Can you all hear me? All right. Will the faculty please be seated? What a glorious afternoon to welcome you to the campus of West Los Angeles College and our 50th commencement ceremony. That is a celebration in and of itself. My name is Jim Limbaugh. I have the pleasure of serving as the president of this fine institution. And we are very excited about your being here today because there are several very special reasons that today is a landmark in the history of this institution. First, we will be recognizing and, and uh, distributing over 1,500 diplomas and credentials today. Now, for those of the audience who are worrying, that doesn't mean 1,500 people going across the stage, just so everybody understands that. Uh, this is also the graduation of our first class in the bachelor's program in dental hygiene. One of only 15 uh, baccalaureate programs in the, city, in the state of California at a community college. And as you will witness in today's ceremony, the most successful program in the entire state with 29 graduates. And finally, if the large 50 balloon didn't give it away, we are kicking off the celebration of the 50th anniversary of West Los Angeles College that first opened its doors to students in February of 1969. So as you can see, there is much to be thankful for today. I will now like to introduce the stage party. On my left, please welcome Dr. Francisco Rodriguez, Chancellor of the Los Angeles Community College District. Dr. Gabriel Buelna, member, Board of the Trustees of the Los Angeles Community College District. The Honorable Sidney K. Comlogger Dove, Assembly Member, California State Legislature. The Honorable Holly J. Mitchell, Senator, a California State Legislature. <laughs> to my right, I would like to welcome Ms. Iris Ingram, Vice President for Administrative Services. Ms. Araceli Aguiar, Vice President for Academic Affairs. Dr. Roberto Gonzalez, Vice President for Student Services. Ms. Stacy Perez, President of the Associated Student Organization of West Los Angeles College. Mr. Abdul Hamid Daraj, our 2018 valedictorian. <laughs> Professor Lin Fran Leonard, our bearer of the mace. And I'd like to introduce um, Professor Holly Bailey Hoffman, the president of the Academic Senate, who's on my list. And where are you, Holly? <laughs> Hiding behind the FICA. Okay. Thank you, Holly. I would also like to provide very special recognition to some very special friends of West Los Angeles College. Members of the staff of the State Chancellor's Office who work closely with the community the faculty and the staff here at West to successfully establish our bachelor's program in dental hygiene and who traveled here from Sacramento to share in our celebration. In the front row are Ms. Jackie Escajeda, Jackie, the Dean of, the dean of Intersegmental Program and Credit Curriculum, and Ms. Najeri Griffin, program assistant with the California Community College Chancellor's Office. They were instrumental in our being able to present the bachelor's degree and, and, and their work is definitely contributing to what we're doing today, so thank you both. Finally, I want to recognize and publicly thank Professor Fran Leonard for her 30 years of service to West Los Angeles College. <laughs> Professor Leonard, our bearer of the mace, is retiring at the end of the semester. Thank you, Fran, for your lasting impact on so many of the graduates that are here today. And to all our administrators, family members, faculty, classified staff, alumni, friends, and graduates, welcome. Now I wish to invite to the podium Ms. Stacy Perez, 
president of the West Los Angeles College Associated Students Organization, who will lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by the national anthem performed by the West Los Angeles College Jazz Ensemble, Ms. Perez. Sorry guys, this is my first time. Okay, will the audience please rise to the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for the national anthem. Put your right hand over your heart and please face the flag. Let's begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Please be seated. Thank you for one of the most stirring renditions of the Star Spangled Banner we've heard in a long time. Thank you so much. I now have the particular pleasure of introducing four colleagues and friends of West who steadfastly work to support and promote the college in achieving our vision to serve as a gateway of success for every student. And we are so privileged to have these individuals here with us today, each of whom will bring greetings and celebration of you, our students. First, I'd like to introduce Dr. Francisco Rodriguez. Dr. Rodriguez is the Chancellor of the Los Angeles Community College District, the largest community college district in the nation, with over 250,000 students enrolled in nine, one of nine constituent institutions, including West Los Angeles College. Appointed Chancellor of the District in 2014, Dr. Rodriguez has worked to raise the district's profile and improve its reputation as the best urban community college district in the nation. 
A noted scholar and education activist, Dr. Rodriguez has 30 years of experience as an educator, faculty member, and administrator within California public higher education. Please welcome Chancellor Francisco Rodriguez. Muy buenas tardes to everybody. Good evening. What a joy it is to welcome you. First, I'm looking for the class of 2018. Where are you? Oh, you look beautiful. It's on now. It's on now. We're here to celebrate with you, to give praise and to give a lift to your academic journey. We know that for so many of you, this was not an easy thing to do that you did not do this academic journey and this accomplishment alone. So if you're able to stand, let me ask the graduates to stand, look for the people who are here for you, and I want you to wave to them and to thank them. Oh, what a beautiful shot. So President Limbaugh, members of the faculty, Trustee Buelna, Assembly Member Cam Lager Dove, Senator Mitchell, we look forward to your inspiring words and thank you and congratulations on nurturing another beautiful class here of West LA, an, an historic occasion today. You know, today we're conferring your degrees, but the important thing is not simply to hang up your degree as a ceremonial object as something reflective, something in the past, I'm going to challenge you to look at your degree as something to look forward to. Let this be your first degree, not your last degree, at West LA College. Your degree is a tool, un herramienta, to make positive and social change in our community. This country, this state, this city, this community needs you to use your academic training and the training that you will have in front of you to make positive change. The wealth and opportunity gap in our communities exists and they are widening. It's up to our generation, your generation, to reduce that gap. And your education is the tool to do that. There is no better indicator of social and economic mobility than education. It is the one thing that nobody, and I mean no one, can take away from you. Your education. So use it as a tool, as a tool for positive and social change. As you move forward, the four words that come to mind are sin fronteras y sin pena, without borders and without fear. No borders, no fear. Be relentless in your pursuit of excellence. Relentless in your pursuit for something that is higher than you can have ever imagined or expected. You know, I think it was Michelangelo who said, the greatest fear in life, in tragedy, is not that you set your goals too high and never reach them, but set them too low and do. You know, Mark Twain said, the two most important days in your life are the day you were born and the day that you found out why. So here, hopefully this degree will allow you to think about the why. You were put on this glorious earth to do something powerful, something imaginative, something constructive, something purposeful. Use your education as a tool for positive social and community change. So we celebrate you today. Uh, this is a, a glorious moment, an historic class of our baccalaureate degree earners today, our associate degree earners. And let me just ask by show of hands, how many of you are transferring to the four-year university? How many of you? Look at that. Oh, this is a great day. This is a great day. Congratulations to you. And I will leave you with this, simply with this. And this is from uh, President Ellen Johnson Sirleaf, first democratically elected woman of Africa, maybe in the world. And she said that your dreams should always exceed your ability to achieve them. If your dreams do not scare you, they're simply not big enough. If your dreams do not scare you, si sus sueños no te dan, Asusto, están muy pequeños, they're too small. So dream big, never settle. Congratulations to you all. Class of 2018.
<laughs> Thank you, uh, Chancellor Rodriguez. He's this way in staff meetings, by the way, so uh, just so you know that. It is my distinct pleasure now to introduce Dr. Gabriel Buelna. Dr. Buelna is one of the newest members of the Board of Trustees of the Los Angeles Community College District. He also serves on the faculty of California State University Northridge, where he teaches history and politics in the Chicano Chicana Studies Department. We are so thrilled that Dr. Buelna has selected West Los Angeles College as the first commencement he is attending in his role as trustee. Please welcome to the podium, Trustee Gabriel Buelna. Honor graduates of the class of 2018, honor guests, family, and friends. Welcome to the 2018 annual commencement exercises here at West Los Angeles College. I'm Dr. Gabriel Buelna, and I'm honored to welcome you on behalf of the Los Angeles Community College District Board of Trustees. Also, while one of our guests here today is not no longer a trustee. I do want to acknowledge Sydney, um, Assemblywoman Sydney Clam Malinger Dove, who was just our, uh, left our president as being our president of the Board of Trustees. When we were deciding where, where, to, where as trustees we would go, I remember I, I said West LA College first. And they were like, why not East? Why not Valley? Why not the other colleges? Not just because. West Los Angeles, this is the 50th anniversary. West Los Angeles College is where my mother in 1986 was on the dean's list here at West LA College. <laughs> West LA College, as a graduate of St. Bernard High School, gave me nine units and allowed me to graduate sooner from California State University in Northridge. And I, just let me say to everyone here at West LA College, thank you. West LA College is where my mother would go after dinner to take English classes, which led to her being hired as a receptionist at the orthopedic hospital. The orthopedic hospital, she was there because my brother is a paraplegic from an, um, an accident from a drunk driver. She was there so much that the doctor said, Mrs. Buelna, why don't you come and work here? But first, your English proficiency needs to improve. She came here for five years. After those five years, she learned sufficient English to receive that receptionist position at the orthopedic hospital. That position allowed her to pay the tuition for my brother Enrique, Carlos Rafael, and myself to go to UC Santa Barbara and Cal State Northridge. West LA College offered my mother, my mother the ability to increase income. Thank you, West LA. Today, we have many graduates, the first class of the LACCD Dental Hygienist Program. And all, and all of the graduates here who will make their dreams happen for their, their themselves, your children, and your future generations that will follow you. Through this ceremony, we recognize our students, the family and friends, our faculty, staff, and administration, and all those who have helped to, to support and inspire us. West LA has a rich history and proud history, and your graduation today marks another glorious chapter. My thanks and congratulations to President Jim Limbaugh and all the faculty, staff, and administration here at West LA College for providing an excellent education to the graduating students. The Los Angeles Community College District is the largest community college district in the, in the, in the state of California and in the country, among the largest in the country. We are proud to be a high quality and affordable education to the citizens of the County of Los Angeles. Over the last 77 years, our nine colleges have educated more than 3 million students. As you leave our wonderful campus, we hope that the learning and education are a permanent part, are a permanent part of your life. This is not only important to you, but to make sure that the building blocks of success are present for the generations that follow you, just like they were from my mother. Some of you have children, some of you don't. Won't, some of you don't. This, will, this will help your children. You understand that they are watching you and emulating everything that you're doing. 
Those without children, please understand that everything you do will affect future generations and those of your neighbors and your community. We all struggle to make the best decisions on a daily basis. Just keep that in mind and understand that we all depend on your good decisions to make our society better. Welcome again to our annual commencement and have a great 2018 class. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dr. Buelna. It gives me a special honor to introduce our next speaker, Assembly Member Sydney Kamlager Dove, for she knows us well, having recently served, as uh, Trustee Buelna stated, as the president of the Los Angeles Community College District. Today, she serves with distinction as the newly elected Assembly Member of the California State Legislature, representing the 54th Assembly District. Ms. Kamlager Dove is a frequent speaker on education issues, economic development, and the arts, among other topics. She is passionate about education, criminal justice reform, and poverty issues, which are central to her work here in Los Angeles and in Sacramento. Please join me in welcoming to the podium the Honorable Sydney Kamlager Dove. Hey, West LA, how you doing? All right, that's what I'm talking about. So welcome and congratulations to our terrific West Los Angeles College graduates. This is a great day. It's a great day for you. It's a great day for your families. And it's a great day for all of us because we are all here to celebrate you. And you only get one day of this, so I want you to take full advantage. As the State Assembly Representative for West, and as has been mentioned as immediate past president of the Los Angeles Community College District, for which I was also a representative of West and eight other colleges, I also have to express my pride and appreciation of this great institution. And Dr. Limbaugh, I continue to graduate, congratulate you and your faculty and your administration for another amazing job preparing our future leaders and scholars and troublemakers and decision makers and solution finders and our future. I also want to celebrate West LA College for its 50th anniversary of extraordinary accomplishment and service to this community. I have to say 50 looks really good. I know on the board we injected a little bit of Botox into this college campus, but just a little. For history buffs, I should also state that this is the 50th anniversary of the assassination of uh, RFK, of Robert Kennedy. So. Just take that, you know, and think about that. All right, back to joyful things. Some of you all, I know the young people are like, who is that? That's why I said it, Google it, Google it. So some of you in the audience are prepared by the only cinema production resource program in the country that provides below the line training for the film industry in partnership with 10 industry trade unions. So where are our future film and TV production workers? All right. All right. When y'all start making movies, think of me. I could be an extra. I would love to get my SAG card. Dental hygienist in the house, can I hear you? A small but mighty uh, curriculum. There are some here who have achieved at the nationally recognized aviation technology program and will be working for airlines, making sure that we are flying safely. Is anyone in the house graduating from our aviation technology? All right. I want free tickets next time I fly. And of course, I expect that somebody here has earned a degree in computer science. Is there anybody here who dug in? All right, brother, keep standing, keep standing. Who dug in, beat the odds, burned the midnight oil, and did what some say you couldn't do and earned a degree from a school with a top 20, I'm gonna say it again, with a top 20 ranking in computer, computer science. Let me hear you. Stand up again, brother, all right. All right. 
Today is about you. Celebrate yourself, graduates, and celebrate your support systems, your family, your friends, your children, your booze, even your haters, because they all pushed you in some way to get to the finish line. I love haters. In, <laughs> and I love booze too, that's right, booze are very important. <laughs> In my brief remarks to the graduates, and that's why they kicked me off, see, because I'll be talking like this. In, your, in my brief remarks to the graduates and your families, I want to salute you and also encourage you to think about a few things. I hope that you stand firmly in who you are. With social media and cultural pressures, we are urged to think and operate and talk in a group. But I suggest that you also consider taking the road less traveled sometimes. Your voice may sometimes be the only one that you hear, but it may also be the only one that everyone else hears. And that means it will be clearer than anyone else's. So stand firm in who you are. I also hope that you will be purposeful in what you do, in who you love, and in who you stand for. This is your life. It is the only one you get. And so own it. Take full responsibility for it and how you want it to progress. And lastly, take care of yourself. Take mental, take physical, take spiritual, take psychological care of yourself. Take time, find time to love yourself, to get to know yourself better. Sickness and atrophy helps none of us. And we all need each other in this thing called life. It only gets better, our families, our jobs, our communities, this state, our nation, this world, only gets better when we are working together, when we are healthy, when we are sane, when we are safe, and when we are learning to love ourselves and each other. So it is my honor to join my old homies, Dr. Buelna and Dr. Rodriguez, and even Senator Mitchell, who was my boss, here to celebrate with and for you. It is my pleasure to continue to represent you as your newest assembly member. And it is my joy, my true joy, to believe in you and what is next for you. Thank you. Thank you, Assemblymember Kamlager Dove. It's now, now my distinct pleasure to introduce the fourth in this collection of extraordinary individuals who are sharing the day with us, California State Senator Holly J. Mitchell. Senator Mitchell represents California Senate District 30. First elected to the legislature in 2010, she has since authored dozens of landmark laws for the improvement of life in California. Most recently, as chair of the Senate Budget Committee, Senator Mitchell in 2017 oversaw the state's $183 billion investment in California's future. Senator Mitchell has been recognized as Legislator of the Year or honored by more than 100 groups statewide for her service to our state. Please join me in extending a warm welcome to Senator Holly J. Mitchell. First things first. You see, I have a millennial, a millennial at home, so I know what to do. Congratulations. You have no idea how fabulous you look from up here. Don't they look great, parents, in the back? 
So Dr. Rodriguez asked you all to stand up and thank those who were here. I'm going to ask you to do something a little different. Some of you were supported by people who aren't here, who are no longer with us or couldn't be here. Grandma and them, Mr. Pell Grant, Madam Cal Grant, <laughs> whoever it may be, faculty and staff, people who are here, the librarian who cut you some slack, whoever it is, just for a moment, even though they're not here, we're going to bring them into this space to participate in this culmination ceremony with you. So think about those people who prayed for you, supported you, threw you, did whatever they needed to do to get you to this point. Some of you with cords, everybody with beautiful blue and black mortarboards. Think about those people, because even though they're not here physically, it's because of them that you are. Can I be perfectly honest with you? I invited myself to today's graduation. There were supposed to be three people there. I invited myself, and let me tell you why. You know, today is election day, and whether you're civically engaged or not, let me tell you why it's important to you. It was the California State Legislature, a former colleague of mine in the State Senate that had a bright idea. He said, we should allow community colleges to offer baccalaureate degrees. He introduced a bill, and all hell broke loose. It did. As is often the case when you have an innovative, creative new idea where you want to buck the trend and do something different. But he understood that there are community colleges in places where there aren't four-year universities across this state. And he wanted to give every Californian an opportunity to have a baccalaureate degree to improve their likelihood of pulling themselves up and out of whatever socioeconomic class you may be in. So he had the idea. I supported that idea and voted for that bill to allow community colleges to have baccalaureate degrees. So I invited myself today because I wanted to see the first graduating class at West LA. Stand up. Stand up. And I'm glad you're a dental hygienist because I almost lost my front teeth voting for that bill. <laughs> but as the assemblywoman said, when you know better, you do better. And I understood that there was a market, that there were constituents of mine here in the 30th Senate District, here at West LA, under the incredible leadership and vision of the women of West LA who were in a board meeting, heard about the opportunity and said, we're going to apply for the grant and bring that to West. I knew all that would happen when I voted for that bill. So I voted and I went to the dentist the next day and got some new front teeth. <laughs> Throughout your time here, you've likely been introduced to a diversity of academic fields and study. Here on this campus, you have seen and experienced true diversity of race, religion, gender, and thought. You've learned firsthand that different perspectives and experiences are critical to recognizing the universal truths in humanity. The knowledge and experiences you have gained through this diversity are necessary to recognizing areas of improvement in the world and to producing change where it's needed most. I hope you remember that. These diverse experiences, both in academics and perspective, amongst an invaluable education are what West LA has given you. Whatever your interests and dreams, I urge you to take these skills, experiences, and lessons and go on to become pioneers and change makers in your own homes, communities, and fields of study. In short, we all expect you to give back. Because today, if you hadn't figured it out before, you have a new level of responsibility. Because you owe us all. You owe us all a debt. Public dollars finance community colleges. All of you who raised your hand saying that you're going on to four year, if you're going to a CSU or a UC, those are publicly funded colleges and universities. Those folks back behind the white picket fence and all of you who work, we pay for that. So you owe us. And today, we're calling in our marker. And you know what we want? We want you to be the best you could possibly be. That's all we're asking. We're asking you to step up, 
step out, be change makers, be excellent in your field of study. We're asking you to be the best because California is the fifth largest economy in the world. It's counted on you to be the innovators to take us into the future. Congratulations, West LA. I'm proud of you. Our valedictorian today is not the stereotype student who has overachieved since kindergarten. Instead, he is a testament to so many at West who has faced hurdles and got discouraged, took a break, and then returned with conviction. This year's West Los Angeles valedictorian is an EOPS student graduating with an Associates of Arts in Business Administration and Associates in Arts in Liberal Arts and Sciences with an emphasis in Behavioral and Sciences and Associates of Science for Transfer in Business Administration. He earned a GP, thank you, he earned a GPA of 4.0 as well as an acceptance letter to Cal State Long Beach. His his future is promising. Graduates and guests, please welcome our valedictorian, Abdel Hamid Duraj. They cried. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. I'm very pleased and honored to be invited to speak today as your uh, valedictorian speaker. Today um, is the day that we'll never forget, all of us. I'm going to share my journey with you guys. I was only 18 years old when I came to the United States from Morocco. Um, I came here seeking new life, um, full of challenges, for new opportunities. And it was not an easy journey. It was not easy for me to adapt. It was, it was very tough. Um, especially that I didn't know anybody. I didn't speak the language. The first thing I did, I came here and I decided to come to West LA College and be here for the first semester. And still, it was tough to adapt with the language, learning the program, and doing all this. So I, so I dropped out. After years and years and years of work and traveling and hesitation, I decided to come back to college back in 2016, me and my best friend, Ismail, who's here with us and graduating. So I, um, we came back, I started in business administration as a major. And although I got accepted to many universities, I decided to take the offer from California State University, Long Beach. I'll be attending this fall. Uh, this journey was not easy for all of us, and it was tough. Some of us, like me, worked full time, and I had to take um, a lot of units every semester, sometimes 19 to 20 units a semester. But I just want to tell all of us we did it. However, we did, not, like, we did not do this alone. There were many people that helped us achieve this and get to this beautiful date. I would like to thank some people that work here at West, First person that I would like to thank, and she's the first person I met, is Miss Acosta. She's my, she's my, um, she was my EUPS counselor. I did my orientation with her. She deserved the credit. She was very encouraging, and I, and she helped me get to this. I would also thank um, Professor Butcher, my math instructor. It was amazing, and I will never forget his business calculus class. I would, li I would like to thank Professor Linda Alexander. She helped me with my speech today, and she encouraged me to enjoy this day. There is a special thanks to someone who really like, played a big role for me to be here today. Dean Selena Akala Burkhart. She, she called me on this. She said, you got to be the speaker. And she convinced me to be here today. So there is special thanks to her. And she did a great job. On, on the other side, I would like to thank my family, my parents, my brothers, my wife. I would like 
to thank a very special person also, Ismail, who's here with us graduating. We started this together, we did this together. It, like it was a tough journey. We took classes together, we supported each other. But from this place, I want to tell him like, the, like he's the best friend and he's a great guy. Uh, uh, <laughs> Before, uh, before we separate tonight, I just want to congratulate all of us and wish all of us a bright future full of success. And this is not our last degree, it is our first degree. So congratulations, go West, go far. Thank you. Thank you. In today's day and age, do you think he'll miss this? It is now my pleasure to introduce uh, Vice President for Academic Affairs, Ms. Ar Aracela Aguiar. Good afternoon. West Los Angeles College gives special recognitions to students who receive the highest standards of academic excellence. Today, individuals who meet the levels of the high achievement can be identified by the braided ropes they are wearing. Students who receive a cumulative grade point average of 3.0 to 3.49 receive a blue honor cord and the distinct honor of cum laude. Will these students please stand and be recognized? Congratulations. <laughs> Students who receive a cumulative grade point average of 3.5 to 3.69 receive a blue and the gold cord and the distinct honor of magna cum laude. Please stand and be recognized. Thank you. Students who receive a cumulative grade point average of 3.7 to 4.0 receive a gold honor cord and the distinct honor of summa cum laude. Please stand and be recognized. Yeah. Woohoo! I now call to the podium Professor Holly Bailey Hoffman, President of the Academic Senate. As specified in Title V of the California Code of Regulations, the Academic Senate, whose primary function it is to make recommendations to the college and the governing board of the district with respect to academic and professional matters as they relate to degrees and certificates, hereby recommends that the students that are to be recognized in today's ceremony have met the college requirements for the associate's degree, bachelor's degree, or vocational certificate and should be awarded the appropriate degree or certificate. I now call to the podium Dr. Roberto Gonzalez, Vice President of Student Services. President Limbaugh, as Vice President of Student Services at West Los Angeles College, I certify that each student receiving today an associate degree, bachelor's degree, and certificate has complied with all the rules and regulations of the Board of Trustees and has, in addition, completed all the required courses as outlined in the college catalog. To represent the college's administration and to explain the requirements of the degree, here is Vice President of Academic Affairs, Araceli Aguiar. Associate degrees are conferred by community college upon successful completion of 60 or more units of college work. The Bachelor of Science in Dental Hygiene program requires 125 units. Certificates are granted to students who satisfactorily complete an organized program of study. Traditionally, academic degrees and certificates are conferred on the recommendation of the faculty. President Limbaugh, it is my honor as Vice President of Academic Affairs for West Los Angeles College 
to confirm that all requirements have been completed and that the candidates be conferred the bachelor degree, associate degree, career and technical certificate, or certificate of completion and co or competency. I would now like to call to the podium because we will begin the presentation of the diplomas. Dr. Rob <clears throat> well, no, actually, that's in another two hours. We have more speakers. Dr. Roberto Gonzalez will return to the podium and he will explain the order of the business. Uh, Dr. Gonzalez. We will now proceed with the presentation of the diplomas, the moment you've all been waiting for, right? <laughs> Dr. Walter Jones and Professor Fran Leonard will announce the graduates' names as they cross the stage. Graduates, please stand and approach the platform when your row is released. <laughs> Family members and guests and friends, uh, when you take pictures of your loved ones, please be courteous to the audience. And Take pictures quickly so everyone will, have, will be able to enjoy the ceremony. We also have professional photographers who will take photos of the graduates that you can purchase at a later date. Also, we know that you will want to scream, yell, and applaud when your family member crosses the stage. We encourage you to do so because this is a landmark event. However, we ask, you, we ask that you keep the celebration as short as possible so that names of the next graduates will be heard. Stephen Charles <laughs> Claire Brown Clark. Darian Downing. <laughs> Reynard Williams. <laughs> Tanya Armstrong. Daniel Arash. Lindsay Peterson. Ibrahim Patel. Cody Crisp. Wynel Rodriguez. Doran Benyamini. Marquita Lathan. Amanda Rafe. Varancia Pugh. Andrea Olivo. Josephine Wanaki. Randy Van Blarkham. Orlando Valladares. Caitlin Apitiger. Kimo Sabi. Masi Rasta. Erin McCormick. 
in He Huang. Alyssa Bridges. Helen Fu. Dana Flores. Christina Cuevas. Lena Avalos. Megan Nicole Alonzo. Jocelyn Gonzalez. Daisy Pantoja. Alundra Alvarez. Nazanin Martin. Josefa Franco. Monique Wolf. Janice Giles. <laughs> Stephanie Rojas Pineda. Christina Villanueva. Deanna Graves. Betsy Escobar. Rosario Marie Atkinson. Hector Cervantes. Guadalupe Purple Flint. Sergio Espeleta. Leanne Bow. Alex Losa. Lily O'Brien. Kayla Corney. Richard Olivello. Ronald Rayborn. Naomi Lincoln. Mary Ben Amor. Michelle Laslovich. Mohammed Ali Kriya. Mai Wong. Wilfred Jamadu Yamje. Laura Barragan. Haley Tillett. Elva Martinez. Shannon Battle. Lizette Hermio. Myra Waters. Sandra Benevente. Charette Marirez. Erica Brooks. Barry Carson. Heidi Quintana. Kyla Francis. Dana Chanel Prayer. Donovan Barnes. Ileana Lafayette Carrillo. Kurt Ewell. Khadija Tuba. Patricia Gutierrez. Antoinette Bell. Brianna Renu. Lydia Kadebu. Najee Wilson. Todras Dana. James Hill. Yodit Alabel. Joseph Isiagire. Eva Vira Corse Colette. Say it again. Sally Cole. Alma Diaz. <laughs> Tiffany Ann Young. Ellie Alvarez. Yolanda Boulard. Rosario Pozo. Emmanuel 
Ofuwape. Leslie Mugger. Dulce Mueller. Mehdi Salehi. Lionel Uloya. Saul Guzman. Aspen R. Angela Orocha. Nicole Barden. Kimberly Reyes Capelson. Alexander Lee Ingram. Marlene Cienfuegos. Michael Owens. <laughs> Evelyn Valdivia. Andrew Melendez. Erica Mendoza. Diana Nakayenga. Maria Vega. Jose Mendoza. Ariel Castellanos. Casey Rich. Ismail El Matalib. Sara Bam Gorbal. Brandon Iwazi. Janan Alalak. Miles Greenwich. Abigail Nathaniel Coker. Christine Sabon. Alyssa Carrera. Ming Lee So. Oscar Galicia. Larinda Johnson. Luz Vega. Alexis McKillian. Jose Munoz. Juliana Tajimoa. Hong Klein. Anna Jovell. Juwaria Mohammed. Lindsay Viatoro. Zenet Mohammed. Jasmine Andrea Palacios. Jennifer Zhu. Jocelyn Yasmina Castillo. Tabari Scriven. Karina Zapata. James Scriven Jr. Demetrius Yulimbo. Andrea Mendez Ochoa. Carrie Ingle. Cheyenne Newell. Laura DeFreit. Jonathan Saltzman. Veronica Jordan. Natasha Nicole Jones. Carlos Gomez. Angelica Mesa. <laughs> Marilyn Rosas. Holly Swift. Kerry Cruz. Yadira Ponce. Ronnell Wade. Saul Duran. Yuri Salgado Nogales. Dolores Orozco. Lily Wynn. Chris Aguilera. Kennedy Madison. 
Dalila Cage. Christopher Whaley. Salma Rockstro. Robert Corletto. Benjamin Hobson. Sandy Pania Garcia. Rebecca Redmond. Jocelyn Itzel Bermudez. Angel Marcio Blanco. Ariana Cien Panin. Opinion, my bad. <laughs> Kenya Martinez. <laughs> Stephanie Marie Cervantes. Damaris Virginia Bernard. Manuel Hakim. Lulit Talema. Mario Moore. Isaac Lopez. Jordan Bird. Eric Gonzalez Mestas. Atronique Logans. Anthony Gonzalez Mestas. Esteban Preciado. Louis Swan II. Aaron Brown. My guy. Whitney Ann Sims. Alexander Johnson. Javier Yepes Jr. Alex Giron. Calvin Green Jr. Foster Dixon. Stevall John Stepanian. Adore Watson. Mr. Keith Green. Paula Resendez. Fatima Luis. Odire Intecume. Brittany Gail Sankey. Jalen Jerome Jenkins. Rochelle Phillips. Khalil Hooper. Rebecca Oprah. I'll give you your space. Cameron Hooper. Joseph David Rodriguez. Joseph Banks. <laughs> Lucia Gonzalez. Genesis Herrera. Karen Hinojosa. Sierra Lopez. Jenny Herrera. Ayla Foreman Martin. Virginia Velasco. Brian Kaikindo. Yolanda Walters. Jacqueline Malady. Karen Ruman. Angelina Angeles. Adam Bach. Ashley Jero. Eunice Padilla. Ryan Robertson. Yam Dord Jidwasuiram. Oh, that's an old one. 
Simone Ritchie. Maribel Cruz Rojas de Jimenez. Javon Singleton. Kaylin Coker. <laughs> the Ariana Brown. Bina Yasharpur. Adam Walker. Mauricio Rodriguez. Tyrant Ship. Celeste Rodriguez. Romel Pinel. Jonathan Maldonado. Roque Pinel. Daniel Amesquita. Taylor Walker Divine. Lenny Don Diego. <laughs> Ellie Conkey. Aisa Ta Keita. Cindy Ayala. Elizabeth Anik Maha. Randy Garcia. Bianca Stevens. <laughs> Marlene Mendoza Savarillo. Yvonne Artero. Dalia Teles Martinez. Ashton Edward Glover Williams. Enrique Munoz Jr. Teresa Esparza. Valerie Alcaraz. Jose Benitez. Michelle Galon. Paula McIntosh. <laughs> Jing Yi Go. Gabriela Buentian. <laughs> Sephora Torrios. Patrick Bischoff. Edgar Mara Queen. Debbie Brown. Emily Simone. DeAndrea Monique Dobson. Kalisha. Efren Platos. Kalisha James. J. Chris Freeman. Joseph Guzman. Olga Malinicheva. Faith Anderson Santos. Tatiana Pilapinko. Charlotte Banks. Katie Hoffman. Got it. Jocelyn Chavez. <laughs> Salvador Garcia. Lorian Beatriz Francisco Villarosa. <laughs> 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 
Giancarlo Alvarado. Deandra Dustin. Ivy Neville. Linda Sandoval. Brandon Matthew. George Hernandez. Debori Huvelin. Maria Diaz. Nanette Young. John Del Rosario. Vanessa Wagner. Mark Arias. Angela Ortega. Angela Ortega. Renata Herzenyak. Natalie Yokobi. Byron Esquivel. James Taylor. Doralis Lagunas. Jasmine Paulino. Andrea Lorenzo. Jimmy Moneres. Elena Azuara. Joanna Graciano. Carolyn Ray Du. Brittany Lynn Oates. Priscilla Vargas. <laughs> Melody Pat Campbell. Derek Harris. Gretchen A. Neville. Jania Robinson. Karen Matulis. Tia Moore. Kisande Sparrow. Stephanie Cassano. Zara Atefe. Valencia Maxine Banks. Lloyd Tahos. Sandra Norio. Sitlali Santiago. Tanya Parker. Jennifer Madrid. Innocent Onya. Tierra Young. Myra Valerio. Tina Rodgana. Candace Alberson. Bianca Quizone. Dunbrell Al 
Roberson. Crystal Gaspar. On win. Genesis Flores. Cora Pornyonkoy. Roberto Robles. Ima Chu. Nora Flores. Nader Ahmed. Julio Yarena. Kevin Godinez. Charles Adams. Alexis Fernandez. Yihan Bryan. Anson Valiu Akam. Carlos Junior Carvajal. Edgar Gonzalez. <laughs> Ronis Moore. Norma Garcia. Kimberly Pato. Yolanda Gong. Joshua Sabalos. Shayna Newman. Marisol Martinez. Jordan William Sadasse. William Wiley Yante. Eduardo Mendoza. Cristo Rosales. Blanca Mesa. Cesar Loya. Michael Carisma. Brandy Peach Bent. Alia McCord. Roberto Romero. Elijah Brickley. Jonathan Yuan. Cindy Rodriguez. Edward Martinez. Tanya Watson. David Aguirre Jr. May Therafi. Angelica J. Harvey. Yolanda Natalia Bustamante. Alma Dublon. <laughs> Melissa Ann Dominguez. Jennifer Galicia. Kevin Zoe Cadet. Adrian Gonzalez. Jubena Obi. Christina Lucero Martinez. Samuel Oban. Cynthia Martinez. Jerry Anthony, Jerry Anthony Jr. 
Gracie Maldonado Valdivia. Jamin Boogie Ballard. Bonnie Perez. Trevor Swish Blackman. Karen Artiga. Prince Obini. Laura Carter. Kyra Williams. Tara Holick. Anna Contreras. Angela Reeves. Hector Contreras. Giovanni Martinez Garcia. Joanna Arnold. Victoria Sanders. Paige Martin. Jessica Escota Herrera. Janice Rodriguez de la Cruz. Jerry Contreras. Giannini Maramag. Brianna Porter. Jennifer Argueta. Lashana Barker. Daniel Chavelas. Siapa Erosco. <laughs> Ruben Hill, the second. It's Tondra Nate Jones. So Tondra Rosemary Nate Johnson. Jones. Tondra Nate, TJ Jones. Maya Coleman. Victor Montez. <laughs> Darling Santa Maria. Jalen Gamino. <laughs> Leslie Michelle Guerra. Jay Casile Gibbons. Brianna Marie Placencia. Abriel Mendoza. Nefri Godoy. Yesenia Gomez. Marlene Debora. Anna Cruz. Miguel Racindas Rojas. Quest Bennett. Jasmine Rodriguez. Valentina Nariño. Veronica Ahumada. Elaine Tavares. Jennifer Diane Aldana. Daisy Mendez. Adriana Cervantes. Jasmine Estrada Trotter. Samantha Alarcon.
Lorenza Morales Arzate. Jose Rafael Gil. Alexis Morales. Jacob Romeo Gill. Robert Edward Oliver. Anthony Bohorkin. <laughs> Josephine Marie Gonzalez. Fernando Ivan Ramirez. Brian Roque Cordero. Hector Ramirez Castillo. Miguel Solis. Michael Daniel Lopez. <laughs> Emily Cervantes. Antonio Mares Jr. Heidi Juliet Oriano. Nicholas Cruz. Heidi Guzman. Diego Nava. Ryan Williams. Dahlia Villasenor. Yashika Dante Mignele Ellis. Estefany Ortega. Valerie Luna Franco. Josue Posadas. Jennifer Gonzalez. Yasmin Alonso. Leslie Arriaga. Jose Villarreal. Amber Urena. Edwin Marzariegos. <laughs> Aaron Lightail. Sabrina Martinez. Balin Casillas. Lily Beth Figueroa. <laughs> Jessica Nettles. Emily Espinosa. <laughs> Sabrina Flowers Bergheimer. Joanna Sondate. Rekha Milton. Rika Milton Nesmith. Nesmith. Patricia Amador. Jackie Mendoza. Robert Delaney. Chanel Vieira. Jennifer Del Cid Millangos. Jesse Zakamitsen. Guadalupe Casas. Juan Tova Perez. <laughs> Ashley Nicole Bryant. <laughs> Katrina Grant. Rachel Ricks. <laughs> Heidi Borrell.
Danielle Livingston. Sonia Bahare Mayer. Vanessa Garcia. Casey Castellanos. Stacy Danielle Gaski Perez. Abdel Hamid Daraz, our valedictorian. Wow. Before we go into the final stages, there's one other group we want to recognize. You all would not be here today without the faith, the support, the counsel, the urging of your faculty. So I'm going to ask all the faculty to stand. Now there's one simple thing to remember, wherever you go, you're never going to get faculty quite as great as ours. Always remember that. <laughs> now, to make this official, on the recommendation of our faculty and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of the Los Angeles Community College District, I confirm that the associate degrees, bachelor's degrees, and certificates which have been conferred upon you as official Congratulations, class of 2018. In closing, in closing, over 50 years ago, over 50 years ago, West Los Angeles College's first president, Dr. Morris Heldman, coined the phrase, just do it, long before Nike entered the slogan to our public consciousness. Now, as we celebrate the legacy of Dr. Heldman's vision for West Los Angeles College, we set off a geyser in his honor. Okay. Now then, I need everybody. Come back to me. Come back to me. It's okay. Come on back. Come on back. Uh, we did that just for you all. Please understand that. As I was saying, Dr. Heldman said, just do it. You have just done it. You each have concluded a very personal journey to bring you to this point. We congratulate for this. Now, you're joining many others who attended Los Angeles College or graduated from here. In fact, I know there's a lot of folks out here, but just I want to see this. Anybody out there in the audience, over 2,000 of you are out there, if you attended West or if you graduated from here, let's show these fellow alumni who you are. Wait your hands. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't that great? So, with that, the final thing we will do 
I ask all students, student to be graduates, to please stand. As a symbol of recognition for your accomplishment today, I now authorize you to switch the tassel of your mortarboard from the right to the left. Congratulations to our newest alumni, and again, congratulations to all of us on this wonderful day, Class of 2018. Now the graduates will be seated for final instructions. Dr. Gonzalez, aww. Make it quick, Roberto, they're getting antsy. All right, I'll make it quick. At this time, I want to give a special thanks to the committee members of the graduation committee and all of the volunteers for their contributions to this commencement. I would like to thank Chancellor Rodriguez, Trustee Buelna, Assemblymember Kamala Verdugdov, and Senator Mitchell for being with us today. I also want to thank the sign language interp interpreters for their work at today's ceremony. Ms. Jennifer Eagle and Ms. Michelle Hernandez, and Professor Fran Leonard and Dr. Jones uh, for their role in announcing the graduate names. Also, our thanks to our singer, Daniela Hurtado, um, Phil Small in the West Los Angeles College Jazz Ensemble, and the outstanding faculty classified staff and alumni who have attended today's ceremony. This concludes our 2018 commencement ceremony. <laughs> Graduates, please be courteous and remain seated for the recessional of the platform party and faculty and staff. Congratulations, class of 2018!